Frontier Works organization was raised on 31st October 1966 to construct the Karakuram Highway, one of the most challenging and ambitious highway projects ever undertaken. Today, FWO, with its range of experience, competence of workforce and the wealth of expertise, is synonymous with excellence in infrastructure development and paving new waves throughout Pakistan and beyond. Currently, FWO is working in federally administered tribal area. The package includes development of 700km road, upgradation of electricity infrastructure and irrigation sector projects. The recently completed Central Trade Corridor opens a new trade route to Afghanistan which is nearly 400 km shorter than the karachi Dorkham route via Khyber Pass. The 217-kilometer-long new road passing through Dera Ismail Khan, Tang, Wana, onto Angoradda at the Park Afghan border has been built over the historic Gohul Pass. The second axis, the northern prong of the Central Trade Corridor, originates from Bannu and connects with Afghanistan at Ghulam Khan while passing through Mirali and Miran Shah with total length of 82 kilometers. Other important roads are 75 km long Wana Shakai Makin and 73 km Makin Razmak Miransha, which join the two prongs of Central Trade Corridor and connect the South and North Waziristan agencies. The Tank Jandola Makin Razmak Road has been completely refurbished, which includes widening of the Jandola and Ahmadwam tunnels and construction of new bridges. Gomalzam Dam is regarded as a harbinger of an upcoming green revolution. With its 260-kilometer canal network, the dam is irrigating 163,000 acres of farmland of Tank and Dera Ismail Khan districts. The Dhana Irrigation and Water Supply Scheme, located few kilometers east of Wana, will utilize the seasonal runoff for irrigation of 13,000 acres besides recharging the groundwater table. Power sector was an important component of quick impact projects and the upgradation of Wana grid station and laying of 132 kV transmission line from Gomalzam Dam power station to Wana grid station has been completed. The legendary Khyber Pass serves as a strategic link between Central and South Asia and the single-lane Peshawar Torkham Road is being upgraded into a 37 feet wide dual carriageway. Sequel to the Government of Pakistan's initiative for improving the ties between Pakistan and Afghanistan, the construction work on Torkham Jalalabad Road has been initiated to expand it into a four-lane dual carriageway. Mohmand Agency is known for its rich marble deposits. The 751-meter-long Nahakki Tunnel and the Ghalanay Mohmand Ghat Road will ease out the transportation difficulties. It's a potential trade route with Afghanistan through Nama Pass as well. Construction of Mirkhani Arandu Road in Chitral has brought a ray of hope for this far-flung area. The 32-kilometer road traverses along the scenic Kunar River and links with the Afghan border. The Jalkhad Chalas Road links the Kaghan Valley with Gilgit Baltistan by crossing 13,691 feet high Babusar Pass and reduces the distance between Mansehra and Chilas 
by 120 kilometers and traveling time by 4 hours compared to Karakoram Highway. Balochistan is a region of immense significance and here FWO is constructing road projects vital for the viability of Gwadar port for the development of interior Balochistan which lag behind due to lack of suitable access. The M8 motorway will connect Gwadar port with Indus Highway at Rattodero through Turbat, Hushab, Avaran and Khuzdar to complete the missing link of Pakistan-China Economic Corridor. The N85 road will offshoot from Thurbat and will pass through Panjgur, Nag, Basima and from Kalat onwards, N25, the RCT highway will stretch further up to Quetta to culminate at the Park Afghan border at Chaman by providing the shortest access to Afghanistan from our seaports. FWO is the pioneer of the build, operate and transfer projects in Pakistan. The recently completed Habibabad railway flyover is yet another beauty project built on the National Highway N5 near Patoki by FWO in a record time of three months. A milestone in promoting the beauty regime is the upgradation of Lahore Islamabad motorway which will be recarpeted with the state-of-the-art plant and equipment acquired for the first time in Pakistan by FWO. Upgradation of service areas, toll plazas and enhanced facilities for travellers that is accident recovery, medical treatment, insurance, theme parks, horticulture, establishment of dedicated FM radio etc. have been planned to revolutionize the communication infrastructure in Pakistan. Similarly, the Karachi-Hyderabad motorway will be upgraded from existing four-lane superhighway to six-lane motorway with allied facilities. The karachi tatha Highway has recently been entrusted to FWO by the Sindh government and reveals the confidence of clients on FWO's BOT expertise. FWO is demonstrating its skills in various avenues of civil engineering and the construction of Shaheed Benazir Bhutto Bridge at the mighty River Indus for connecting Rahim Yar Khan with Rajanpur is a pertinent example in this regard. The experience of constructing landing strips and airports all over the country enabled FWO to construct the state-of-the-art new Islamabad airport as a joint venture with China State Construction and Engineering Company. In the field of land development, FWO is a trusted organization with prime clients such as THA, OPF and WAPTA to name a few. Optic fiber cable project is a new feather in FWO's cap and in the last few years 7,781 km optic fiber cable was laid all over the country. For expanding its foreign operations, FWO has opened up an office at Dubai for taking up projects in the vibrant market of United Arab Emirates. Presently, FWO is working on construction of prefab villas in Dubai and Sharjah. From connecting cities and towns across the length and breadth of Pakistan through world-class roads, railway network and aviation facilities to improving the country's infrastructural capital by expanding its irrigation and energy resources, FWO is working as a catalyst for a better tomorrow.
with each new landmark. FWO is striving to achieve greater laurels for itself and for Pakistan.